Good afternoon, President Drew Faust. This is Brazil. I'm back to Brazil. In fact, I'm in front of University of Sao Paulo Medical School. After one year research experience at Harvard School of Public Health in Boston, it was an extraordinary experience, experience being there. I was there last month. So for one year, 2011, I've been there doing research at Harvard School of Public Health in the Department of Environmental Health, and I was mentored by Joseph Brain. And this was really interesting because Joseph Brain just gave me lots of opportunities to think from the beginning of an experience to the end and writing about it. In fact, I'm in the process of writing about it. And now I'm back here to medical school and it has been really interesting to be part of a team in the lab, think about new ideas, new things about science, and now being back to the medical school and apply those ideas and part of them and part of the knowledge and the lessons I, I got from them and from Joe here in a medical course and with the patients. So I am just would like to think about uh, Mr. Lehman and how important it was to have the, his support uh, in my life and about going to Harvard. I think I'm now in the fourth year of medical school. I've been there, I've just, uh, there in Boston, I was just in the third year. I finished the third year and then I went for one year research experience. And it was amazing. It was really challenging. In fact, when I got there, uh, Jill, Joe Brain, my mentor, he just gave me the opportunity to be not just part of a project, as to take ownership in this project. So I've taken ownership on a research project. It was really challenging for me, but it was great. After one year, I think it was just great. And now I'm writing and trying to finish everything I've done. So now to help and to collaborate and to share the ideas we've done for one year with the research community and the scientific community. So it was just great. And I think that support I had was fundamental. Without the support from Mr. Lima, I would not be able to first to go abroad and second to go to Boston. That is a challenge. Sao Paulo here is a really nice place. You have great universities, University of Sao Paulo, which is really expensive. So I live here uh, in a house in the dorms of our university. And uh, going to Boston was a challenge and the support was fundamental for me to have this kind of of experience, research experience and, and uh, living experience there in Boston. So this was just great. So about the, the training and knowledge I received at Harvard and what I'm able to achieve, I think that what I learned is that good people attract good people and Harvard is an example of that as University of Sao Paulo is an example of that. I think we here at the University of Sao Paulo, as you there at Harvard, we have great people. And uh, I think this is just amazing and this is something that is really powerful and being around people that love what you do and people that just are passionate about it it's just making you progress this make you excel and want to excel and move things forward so I think the things that made me to achieve being one year at Harvard the greatest thing was to get in touch with people that are just extraordinary and love what they do here at the University of Sao Paulo we have this, there at Harvard you have this in a global scale. So this is really nice and this was just a great opportunity. So basically I did course at Harvard, the research experience at Harvard was my main focus at Harvard. And then I did a course at MIT, Innovation Team Commercializing Science, that is pretty much about what I want to do for the rest of my life, that is the innovation process. And uh, a course at Babson College. I did a course about entrepreneurship at Babson College. So the three experiences, researching at Harvard, doing some course at Harvard, doing a course at MIT, and doing a course at Babson College was amazing. And thanks to the support of George Paul Lemon, I could do that. And now I want to apply here in medical course and here at the University of Sao Paulo. So is there a sort of anecdote you could tell that would illustrate the impact you yourself are having on your community? Well, I think not just me, but the group. We call ourselves USP Harvarders because we come from here, from the University of Sao Paulo, and we are having an experience there at Harvard. So I think one of the things that not just me, but our group we are doing is trying to share the opportunities we are having with the next year students. We want to move this project and this research experience forward. So we have developed the USPHarvard.com. That is a website. Where, where we put posts, so we told what we did for one year at Harvard. So this way we received lots of emails and people from high school. This was really nice because we received posts and emails from people from high school asking about, oh, how, how can I go to Harvard? Should I go to University of Sao Paulo to go to Harvard? How is the experience like there? 
So we could give them this feedback about not just applying for University of Sao Paulo for the best university in Brazil, but also to applying to Harvard, MIT, and the Ivy League universities. So I think this is a kind of impact, uh, not just me, but our group we are having uh, here the students who want to excel here in Brazil. So it's uspharvard.com. Another idea that we had, our group had, is to have the opposite. That is to have the harvardusp.com. So this was just launched. It's an idea to receive you at Harvard here at our university. So we think that we have great opportunities here, especially related to medicine. We have, and we know, we've been there, we know that Beth Israel, MGH, Children's Hospital are just amazing in terms of technology. But we think we have some competitive adventures, as in primary care, as in trauma, as in pathology. So we have things that we believe that we are really competitive in terms of medicine and we would like to share with you at Harvard College, at Harvard Medical School, for you to come here and to enjoy it and be received by us the same way we have been received as I've been received by Joe Brain and environmental health. So this I think is part of the impact. This this USP Harvard and Harvard USP.com has been just amazing the way we've been in touch with people not just from Brazil that want to go abroad as people from United States that would like to come to here to University of Sao Paulo. In fact, we're really happy because this is already happening. We have a maca here, we have team coming. So some people from Harvard College just finished their last year in Harvard College and are coming here to have a research experience uh, here in Sao Paulo and at the University of Sao Paulo. And we are thinking also about not just about medicine, but to make it broader, to make it to engineering school, to law school, to give you at Harvard all the opportunities, not just in medical school, but engineering, at, at economics, at a, uh, law school. So this is the next steps we're thinking about. So I think this is something that uh, is really nice. What are your hopes for Brazil? Well, <laughs> Brazil is just uh, warm and nice, an extraordinary place to be. So it, this is the way we think about it. And we here, we have lots of challenges. You have challenges as well there, but we think we have lots of challenges. Brazil is a country to be built, and we think we should be and we will be the part of this building process. This is what we are studying for, this is what we are doing our practice for. So this is a hope for Brazil, is that we improve the, the health, and the quality of life, not just of the, a little bit of the people, not just of a few people, the people that have the highest socio-economic place, but for everybody. So how to extend with the resource we have, these opportunities we have in Brazil, not just for a few, but for all the community and for all the population, this is our challenge. And about the hope for Brazil, I think, is a country to be built, and we are being a process, and we are being a part of it, and we want to be. So it's... It's just amazing to be here. So, as an agent, an agent of change for your country, I think that we here at the University of Sao Paulo, as people uh, at Harvard and other great universities, we just want to think about problems that are not just important in terms of theory, but in terms of practice. So, I think uh, uh, being a, an agent of change is this is about thinking about the practical in terms of how we we can. We can, we can do to have a, a, a direct impact in the, the life of people. So, how do you see yourself in, the, in this change? Um, well, my, my dream, my dream is to be, is to be part of projects in health, so to be part of projects that have an impact in the health of people. So in the years to come, we have this challenge of, we have a middle class in Brazil that is growing and have access to health and we want to improve the quality of this health. So this is, I think, is to be part of practicing health and to have an impact in these people. This is, this is the dream. So are there any words of thanks you'd like to offer to Mr. Lima as you reflect on your time as a Lehman Fellow? Well, being a Lehman Fellow was just extraordinary. I'd like to, to thank you, Drew Faust, to coming here last year to University of Sao Paulo Medical School and to also say to you again that you are very welcome here to come back and to share ideas and to share opportunities. We would like to share these opportunities as well. So you and your students, they are, you are very welcome here. To George Paul Lema, I would just like to say that uh, your grande sonho 
é, daqui a um tempo participar desses projetos na área de saúde e ter um impacto e ajudar o nosso país a continuar sendo número um. Grande abraço!